It's hard to imagine anyone more vulnerable than a child without a parent. That's why we have a foster care system to help them as they grow. But once they turn 18, the state's legal and financial responsibility for them ends. And that leaves many young people, some of whom have lived with multiple families during their childhood, struggling with adult responsibility, all too often finding themselves completely unprepared. Researchers say nearly one-third of the 4,400 foster youth who turn 18 this year in the state of California will end up homeless for at least part of their first year as adults. That's why my bill, Assembly Bill 719, seeks a federal waiver to give those young people a year of non-state, federally funded, food stamps to help them have a softer landing and a better start in adult life. Recent studies have shown that nearly half of these young people have not completed high school. About 65% of them, if you can imagine that, have no place to live when they leave their foster home. On the average, they make only about $6,000 a year, and nearly half of them have periods of unemployment within their first four years as an adult. Perhaps the most troubling statistic, more than 70% of state penitentiary inmates have spent at least some time in the foster care system. One way to turn these numbers around is to make sure we don't kick them out into the cold on their 18th birthday. My bill softens the landing and does it with non-state federal money. It's the least we can do.